How to fix paper feed issues in the HP LaserJet Tank 1020, 1500, 2500, and HP LaserJet Tank MFP 1005, 1600, 2600 printer series. If you receive an out of paper error message on the printer control panel, on the HP Smart App, or if the printer icon and attention lights begin blinking, then you may be experiencing paper feed issues. Depending on your printer model, you might also see the control panel displaying an ER03 error message. Step 1. Check the printer paper. Remove the paper from the input tray. Fan through the pages and remove any bent, wrinkled, or torn paper in the stack. Check for and remove any obstructions inside the paper tray, such as loose pieces of paper. Load the stack of paper back into the paper tray. Slide in the paper width guides until they rest against the edges of the paper. Step 2. Print a cleaning page. This step will help remove dust and other elements from the paper rollers that might be causing a feed error. Make sure paper is loaded in the main tray and, if it is not already on, turn the printer on. Open the HP Smart App and select your printer. Select Advanced Settings. Depending on your operating system, you might need to select Printer Settings first and then select Advanced Settings. Select System and then select Service. If prompted, enter the username and password for the printer. If you have not changed the password, you can find both the username and password or PIN on the label beneath the toner access door. Locate Fuser Cleaning Mode Select Start, and then select OK. On the printer control panel, press the Resume Cancel button. The printer begins the process and uses a single piece of paper to clean the fuser. Once the process is complete, you may discard the paper in the output bin. Step 3. Clean the pickup roller. Cleaning the pickup roller on the printer will help prevent future paper feed issues. To do this, gather the following items a lint free cloth, and distilled or filtered water. Turn off the printer. Unplug the power cord from the back of the printer. Remove the stack of paper from the input tray. Carefully flip the printer on its side. Pull the blue latch towards the front of the printer to unlock the bottom panel. Then pull the bottom panel outward and remove. Lightly dampen the cloth with the water and squeeze any excess water from the cloth. Press the cloth against the roller and rotate it away from you using your fingers. Apply moderate pressure to remove any dust or dirt buildup. Wait approximately 10 minutes to allow the pickup roller to dry completely. Pull the blue latch towards the front of the printer and insert the bottom panel at an angle to align it back into position. Then release the blue latch to lock the panel in place. Carefully flip the printer back to its original upright position. Place the stack of paper back into the input tray and slide the paper width guides until they rest against the edges of the paper. Plug the power cord back into the printer and turn on the printer. Step 4. Reset the printer. With the printer plugged in and turned on, disconnect the power cord from the printer. Unplug the power cord from the power source. Wait 60 seconds. Reconnect the power cord to a wall outlet and to the printer. Note, HP recommends plugging the printer directly into a wall outlet. Turn on the printer to complete the reset. Step 5. Service the printer. If you are still experiencing the same error on your printer, you might need to have it serviced. Contact HP Customer Support at support.hp.com forward slash contact HP to schedule a product repair or replacement. You can also check your product warranty information at support.hp.com forward slash check warranty. Click the Playlists tab in YouTube to find HP videos in other languages. And search our channel to find official HP support videos.